Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today I have for you a tonic craft kit. This is kit number 73 and this one is called Jingle Bells and Baubles. It's going to be really amazing 3D projects, Christmas inspired. I can't wait to show you. So um, if you need to tonic studios and you need to tonic craft kits, basically you can get these craft kits from tonic studios as a one-off or you can subscribe to monthly kits. I'll put the um, link to tonic studios in the description box if you want to go ahead and get yourself one um, these are only available through tonic studios not through any other retailer so i will put the link in the description box so inside these box boxes you get your nouveau products which are like your embellishments this time i've got a little leaflet you can also see a full pad six by six pad you get your dies and stamps and you also got get a4 papers and cards so what i'm going to do i'm going to go through each of these little things with you so the first thing in my kit is this jingle bells um leaflet it's got a qr code um and this can take you to the craft uh, blog you've got a little idea of what these can make you can see they're so so adorable and then inside you get um a list of what's inside your kit so you can just have a look here so that is really really handy and good to have you can also put this inside here so i'll show you that in a sec i want to go through the papers before i go into my dies so you get some craft perfect a4 sheets and these are all that mirror card there's quite a few mirror cards in this which is perfect for christmas projects so let's get into these you get your gold glitter card you get your craft perfect classic card and this is the dark green so you get a sheet of that you get two sheets of the red you get a silver mirror green mirror card red mirror card and gold mirror card so this is your beautiful christmas selection sticking with the papers and cards you also get a six by six which is great it's a full size six by six pa uh, pad and this one is called gold bullion let me just get in here this is going to be perfect to use with your kit and that's the nice thing about kits they're put together so so well so in this you get four colors six of each and these are 250 gsm and oh my gosh look at the sheen and shine on that so you get gold mirror you get like a matte satin so different finishes in these this is a slightly different gold i love this gold shade and then you get the matte satin version of that so you can see how beautifully they work together Okay, so you get a full six by six pad of that. Onto the Nouveau products. So this time, ooh, you get full size products in this one. So you get the Chili Red Double Satin. And this is Ribbon Perfect again. And this one is the nine millimeter one. So the five meters on these rolls. I love using my tonic ribbon. You also get the double sided red liner tape and this is 3mm perfect for your 3D projects. You see me use red liner tape all the time. I've got some dual dot markers. These are the metallic ones and you've got these colours and they're double ended. So you've got those and then you've got full size products, more of them get this glitter drop this one is called white blizzard it's got this beautiful glittery i'm going to show you like this actually I'm just going to grab some paper because i absolutely love this perfect for christmas projects can you see the speckles of iridescent glitter in that it's just beautiful okay so you get a full bottle of that you also get a full size of this gold, just get out of the packaging. This is the gold glimmer paste. Oh my gosh, that is just so beautiful. And this is called 
they've all got proper names so I'm going to tell you glittered gold and that is exactly what it is so so lush let me put it this way so you can see what it looks like and then you get two of these craft perfect low tack dye tape these are amazing and i think i mentioned it on one of my previous videos this is the best low tack tape you're ever going to use it doesn't tear your paper it doesn't stick to anything it just does its job and it just puts down your dye to your paper and then it's easy release so 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 good they've included this in this month's kit now on to my dies so this folder contains my dies and a little stamp sheet you can see all these stamps I'll show them to you so these are all the sentiments you're going to get to use with your bells and baubles it's a really really nice selection you can obviously use them in your cards as well so the dies themselves so you get two sheets a5 in size full of your dies get this one out as well and you can see straight away that they're going to be a really really nice size so your dies consist of the sides the decorative verso dies and then you've got your tops and bottoms you've got your tabs for flipping things over and you've got your little hoops here that are going to create the top of your bauble or your bells some decorative elements here as well and then there's a little tag here and then this says joy so really really nice selection of dies i can't wait to use them and of course you get your instructions as well so if you ever get stuck you always keep this in your little folder so what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut some bits and pieces and when I get my kits I try to use all the papers and cards that are in the collection but obviously you can use whatever papers and cards, patterned paper, um, Christmas themed, non-Christmas themed to create your baubles and bells, just you can use whatever you want. So let's get cutting. Okay so for the teardrop Christmas bauble the instructions are really really easy to follow actually and it shows you how many pieces of which die you're going to need and then you've also got the photo image of what you're going to be ending up with. So it's a teardrop bauble because it is pointed at the bottom like a teardrop and it's going to create this beautiful design. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to quickly show you the bits and pieces I've cut out. So the only thing I've used that's not in the kit um, for this particular bauble is some white embossing powder and I've also used a bit of white card. So this is going to create my top section. This stamp set is really, really nice, really adorable. You can use these on cards, on these projects, just a versatile little stamp set and get so many different um, sayings on there. So I've got my um, top of my bauble. Then I've also cut and prepped the bottom of my bauble, which is going to go this way. And here I've already scored and put my red liner tape. Along with the red liner tape, I will be adding a tiny bit of wet glue just so that it never falls off. And then I've also got the cap, the little tiny um, closures. I'm not sure if I'll be using these or not. These are to loop some ribbon through, but I think I'm just going to use some magnets. This is for the top of the hanger and then I've got a tab for opening and closing. This is going to connect the top section together and then the white card I said that I used um, is to create these um, hexagons so that I can adhere them to the base of the top and the bottom. Okay, so this is the only extra little thing that I've used. And then I've also made a bit of an embellishment using the dies in the kit. Okay.
have it. That finishes my adorable teardrop Christmas bauble. I think it's so, so cute. And obviously after you've used your papers and cards from your kit, you can use whatever colours you have in your stash. So really, really cute. And actually it's quite spacious inside, so you can add whatever gift you like in there. I would add some tissue paper and then maybe a special gift. If it's jewellery, that would look really cute as well. So that is my first one. I have made the belt as well, so I'm just going to quickly show you the difference. So when you're making the, um, the teardrop bauble, you're going to need six of the top sides and six of the bottom. But when you make the bell, you're going to need 12 of the section we've used on the top here because let me just get it in here and just show you what I've done so here is the bell so if you can see the top is exactly the same as how I've done the top on this one and then these sides are stuck exactly the same way except the bell side just goes outwards when you're sticking the tabs and then you're going to need to make another one of these and that goes on the inside so you just shove it in and stick it on to the top of here so you can see how that is stuck to the base to that hexagon here you see so again really really easily put together and like I said it's almost the same way to construct it's just that the shape of the bottom bit is different where this one goes in these just point outwards and then you just need to put another section of that underneath really clever it's a nice big size and here what i've done i've used the mirror card and the gold glitter card i've added a bow here to the closure again i've done the same thing with the magnets so it closes nicely and then on the top i've added the joy tag with some of the um, holly leaves and then I had some of this um, embellishment in my stash so I used that and I added the red ribbon on the top so it's nicely um, finished for hanging so that came out really cute so this one when you open it again the size of the inside is almost identical it's actually identical except you can see the difference of the base so you've got a bigger base on this on the bell but the storage section, let me just get that tape backing out, the storage section is exactly the same. So really, really beautiful die set. It's a really, really fun kit. Um, like I said, it is only available through Tonic Studio. So if you're interested, go ahead and go and grab it. And um, I hope I've inspired you to create one of these. And when you get your kit, have fun with it. Enjoy creating your baubles and your bells so, so that is it from me for today i'm trying to hold this up so you can see a bit better let me just put that like so so you can see how it looks um so yeah really really cute very very handy very unique design and of course you get all the embellishments as well that you can play around with and decorate your baubles and bells however you like so that is it from me for today thank you so much for stopping by and i will see you all very soon take care bye